Well. Looks like another SU-24 raid coming in on my carriers. All right, so we did take out the, at least, that, I, yeah. Oh, hang on, so, you select all reference points, okay. So at least I did take out those two radar sites. My other two strikes on the S8 battalions weren't that well. So, taking a couple of hits, but it looks like I depleted that second strike too. Looks like pretty much everything is heading back to the bar now. All my fighters are heading back. A couple of F4s are still in the fight though. Still splashing MIGs. Alright, well, I guess it's time just to go for the whole enchilada here. I'm not going to get those two. I don't have an... I don't think I have the firepower remaining, I don't think. To take out... Oh. So, hang on. Um, order of battle, I know I'm missing it. Um, Brass and area platforms. Not what I wanted. Order of battle, right there in front of my face. Okay. Just trying to see how many. It's not really going to tell me. This is the easier way to check. How many F4s? So. I lost a lot of Thunder Chiefs. So I pretty much lost half my uh, half my Thunder Chiefs in that strike. Seems like I still got most of my fighters or my F4s. Okay. So I think I'm just gonna have to risk it. I'm gonna have to just send in my bombers. I'm not gonna. I don't have the time I need here to uh, to suppress the AD and the time remaining in the scenario. So I'm just gonna have to go for it. I've got walleyes there. I only have four armed with strikes though. So 
they're all assigned to bar cap. Okay, so I'm just going to have to go for it. So let's do... Like those two. Add new mission. Strike. And strike. USN. All right, so we are just, we want to take out the runways, take out the runways. I want to remove all the tarmac space from this weapon. So hangars, aviation gas facilities, take out the tarmac, terminal building, we don't want that. Hangar, tarmac, tarmac, runway access points, we don't want to kill. Control tower, yes, no. Just want to go after aircraft facilities. So, uh, hangars, aviation gas, civilian hangars, civilian terminal building, control tower. Take out the runway access points. So surface bunkers. Take out. Alright, so this is going to be the Alpha Strike here, basically targeting all of the hangars, aviation gas facilities, and the bunkers. And I'm going to assign pretty much all of my A7s to this mission. I'm going to assign all right, so we got that. These actually should be returning to base. I don't think those are. So assign all my A7s to the mission, except those four, no. We got the unavailable units. Because I also have a couple in here armed with strikes. While I, while I snake eyes. Okay, yep, yep. All right, so we got that. I also want to set up a define area here. A new mission, patrol, SED patrol. Then on my F7s. And assign my Corsairs armed with walleyes. Or shrikes, I mean, not walleyes. Okay, so we got that. So they'll patrol that for deselect all reference points. Alpha Strike refill mission, and I will add my Crusaders that are ready with buddy stores. The other thing I need to do here is my bar cap mission and doctrine does not use should not use refuel and unrep.
Use refuel unwrap, never. Automatic evasion, yes. Kinematic. All right, there we go. Um, FTP, I've never actually tried setting up a, an SCAD aircraft as an escort. I would, when I hear escort, I assume it means it's going to go for, I think it's an air-to-air -air escort. I don't think it's an actual, um, I don't think it's an actual, like, escort. It'll do that. It may. I actually have never thought of doing that. I'll have to test that out here. All right, so then while I'm going to do that, I might, might as well add new mission, land strike, take my bombers off of the rally mission. And USA of bombers. So I can remove everything except for the runways at Kefalvik. Reykjavik runway, all right. So those are its targets, Kefalvik and the Reykjavik runways. And go. All right, so you can see the bombers breaking out of their uh, out of the rally. Got another MiG-23. So there goes the, there's all my bombers. And you can see the Alpha Strike beginning to launch over here. So make sure that those are going. I think those are all going just for, so stop, 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 stop. I don't like this. Remove targets. So keep those two runways. I'm going to split. There we go. Okay. That should work better now, hopefully. Hopefully these will pick out new targets. Where are these? The hell? RTP mission over. Oh. Oops, <laughs> uh, I'm an idiot. Unassign those. So that's a delete mission, create new mission, land strike, USA of bomber two. 
really helps if you select the right type of land attack mission rather than just selecting uh, air intercept. B-52s can't do air to air very well. I have no idea what these... I'm just going to let them go in. Like, it's just a pain in the ass trying to manage these right now. I screwed it up, and I think they're just going to go after whatever target they fucking feel like it right now. Alright, so I have lost a fighter over here. That Sparrow's probably going to miss now. Alright, so there's the Alpha Strike coming in. Not sure how that one crashed, because it ran out of fuel. I had two aircraft run out of fuel. How is that? There we go, I want to clean this up. I don't want to see targeting vectors right now. So I am getting SAMs. I am going to take a whole hell of a lot of losses because I didn't clear those SAM batteries out. But it's the best I can do. All right, so it looks like bombing passes have been completed. GPP missed Kefalvec runway by 2,000 feet. <laughs> not even in the, not even within a mile. <laughs> All right, well, I mean, they are bombing from 36,000 feet, so I guess it, it's there's a reason why those bombs probably fell that far off target. But man.
Do I have anything else over here in the holding pattern? Oh, my RFF4s. All right, well, how'd that strike go? Um, losses and expenditures. So two hangers, four hangers. So what's that? So two, six, seven hangers, one gas facility. One radar or two radars, one gainful TEL, 21 fencers, 28 floggers. That's not too bad. Vehicle straight, flush. So NATO, I've lost four Corsairs. I lost two B-52s, four F-105 so far, two F-4s, six of my Crusaders, and one Sea Sprite. So all in all, not awful. Definitely not going to be able to completely neutralize that uh, Keflavik, that's for sure. But got two hours to go. We'll see how uh, see if I can get have enough time to get a second round of strikes airborne here. How long until my A7s are ready to go? So about six hours, so there's no way these are going to be ready to go for a second strike within the hour, within the allotted time limit. I may have to check that because it says the risky battle group can launch two alpha strikes in two hours. So I wonder if that only means that you have to basically launch the first alpha strike like right away at the very start in order for that to actually apply. I didn't actually look to see how long the scenario actually was in the beginning. I have to go take a look at that. Any idea what that is? Uh, BE-12 male. One of the two. Still got some Phantoms airborne. Now they're splashing ASW. So everything else should be on, it's pretty much on its way home. Here's my B-52s returning. Hey, they still got some machine gun bursts left. They could have strafed ground targets with those. Alright, well since I think I'm pretty sure I'm not going to have time for a second round of strikes. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. This will just let this run. I'm really, really bad at launching like alpha strikes and these these type of strikes that you know everything has to be you know arrive right on target at the same time. I'm just awful at it.
All right, we'll still have an hour and a half to go in the scenario, and it, I have not triggered victory conditions, so it's unlikely I'm actually, in fact, it's impossible I'm not going to get that, considering I don't have, I'm not going to be able to launch a second round of strikes. So with that, I think I'm going to call it a day. Thank you, uh, everybody, uh, for joining me, and uh, I will be picking this up next week with uh, next with the next scenario in uh, in line, which is damn the torpedoes next weekend. So thank you all for uh, joining me today. Remember to uh, follow me here on Twitch, follow me on YouTube at Kushan or uh, at Kushan Gaming. And I'm also Kushan Gaming on Twitter. And I will see you all next week. Bye.